Like this, son of a bitch. How am I just talking about a panis? It's some nasty little fucking. You little fucking gremlin. Isn't that a gremlin oh, laugh? It is a grim laugh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> He's a jack o' lantern, dude. You are. It's almost spooky time. I know. We've reached the spooky time. The you, spooky cycle. Yeah, it's almost spooky time. We just wait for Halloween over and over. Yeah, I love yeah. Halloween, dude. What are you going to go as this year? Oh, dude, I don't know. We had a couple ideas. What the fuck? I might I go to Fetterman and just wear like... Fetterman would be nice. My, just my normal outfit. <laughs> swear hoodie and gym shorts. Uh, yeah, bring it up. I just saw Fetterman. He was talking. He sounds all right. He does? He's a lot better. Yeah. Maybe he, he saw Jamie Foxx. He's recovering from that. Yeah, true. They Went bounced the Jamie Foxx back. Or you think... I don't want to start political talk, but you think he got cloned? That's a tough one they to might clone. Have Fetterman, Fetterman might be the hardest. Yeah, clone. true. It's a tough guy to clone. It's a tough one to recreate. Who's Fetterman. Right? Fetterman's a giant senator from yeah. Pennsylvania. Yeah. That's, he had a stroke and then he oh. they kept putting him on debate stages. Was he, was he all banged he up? Was he? He literally couldn't talk. <laughs> yeah. They Strokes. brought it, the first debate he went on. They were like, "All right, opening comments are to you, Mister Fetterman." He goes, "Pennsylvania, good night." <laughs> They're like, oh man! Oh, that was and he won. Bit. He beat the other guy. He yeah, won. That, that the other guy, guy sucked say. so bad that he won. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot. Of strokes and Alzheimer's are all the rage right now. Yeah. The other guy, who was the guy who was having a stroke that everyone was like, I hope you fucking McCall, die. Um, uh, I hope you fucking die. McConnell, yeah. I gotta go my Twitter. Do you mind? Oh, you guys Rich, mind if I Mitch? pause right now and go to Twitter and say, I hope you fucking die, McConnell. Yeah. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. yeah. I hope he <laughs> dies. I hate that politician so much. I'm sick of him. I heard he voted on abortion. I want to kill him. Yeah. Myself. You're allowed to wish death on your political enemies. Yeah. That's it's a embarrassing. Good thing. Pretty humiliating. But if you go on and say, I hope Nancy Pelosi dies, they're like, no. Yeah, true. Or who's the other lady they all loved? Ruth, Ruth Beth Bader. Ginsburg or- she did die, and she actually cost them yeah. a lot. She uh, cost them abortion. Yeah, oh, bitch. really? <laughs> yeah, she was. She should have retired. She would retire. Yeah, she, she should have retired under Obama. She was like yeah. Chuck Liddell. Just yeah. like wouldn't get out yeah, of there. Yeah, she wouldn't get like, out. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, it's not good for anyone. Chuck, don't go in there. <laughs> it's got to be so hard. I, I Fuck wouldn't get out. I'm fighting Rampage him. Jackson. <laughs> Dude. Chuck, don't fight a guy named Rampage Jackson. Chuck, you don't know your name anymore, Chuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The days are gone. Chuck Imagine, God. though, dude, could Chuck you give God. up that seat? I yeah. would, they were like, we should have term limits. Like, dude, if I got in there, I would not be able to step down from being like, nay. It's just too powerful. The gentleman from Rhode Island, nay. Nay, absolutely not. You got to give that up. I'd be like, no fucking over my dead body. Yeah. Yeah. I that vote in favor I mean, of the motion. Yeah. It's like, it's we should, they should not be able to insider yeah. trade. Oh, now you're saying it? Now my nuts Before I went on, I said I should change shorts. My penis and nuts are <laughs> I don't care out. if your penis is out. I don't want my penis out. Why? Mine's securely nestled in my groin. Mine will be nestled nicely. <laughs> Mine's a baby bird in its mother's nest right It now. is. Oh, just... <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Cully, fresh off the special. Dude. Yeah. How do you feel? Uh, it's been v- very well received. Very yeah, nice I, messages. Which I, wa- nice I watched it today uh, and I thought it was really great. Thanks. I didn't it. share it yesterday because I think the good move was sharing somebody special is the next day. True. Yeah. Everybody shares it at once. True. Yeah. You got to wait a couple of days and then you give it a nice. Yeah. Yeah. If you share that, would be great. I appreciate it. Of course. If someone goes watch sure. it. Most importantly, you big Philly fan base here. I'm going to be at Helium on September 20th. 
Nice. Tickets, Ooh. plenty available. <laughs> 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 to the, the point where I may not actually be there. No, you're going to be there. there. Dude, they so got to be a lot of, so, yeah, lot so of well. lazy, late yeah, ticket yeah, buyers yeah. in Philly. I saw a flyer, I walked by it. Did you? It's my neck of the woods. Oh, nice. Oh, at least I promoted that. Oh, it was up on the front part? Mm -hmm. That's cool. Oh, that'll, okay. I was All so right. happy when I saw my fat face on there for the first time. Yeah. I said, Mama, we did it. I said, Baby, yeah. break out the red panties. <laughs> Baby, we done it. I called my mom, actually. Did you really? <laughs> I said, Mom, break out the red panties. <laughs> I didn't quite Jane. understand what that meant. Yeah, break out the floral pattern. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Break out the big floral pattern. Break briefs, out mom. the giant stained underpants. <laughs> 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 the shit straight underpants, Mom. <laughs> what point do you think women just give up their sexy underpants? I don't think it's up to them. I think their vaginas give out. <laughs> That what it is. is mung and yeah. shit flies out of it for years. <laughs> the vaginas eat them, probably. The, vagi the vaginas give out. Yeah, just, they probably like claim them. The vaginas probably like oh. all day. The vaginas are just. <laughs> 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 mm. <laughs> Although yeah. it is a period of rest and recuperation. Geezed? Yeah, they don't break those things out all the time. No, they might but... zap them every. <laughs> I think they get hit with the bug zapper, yeah. <laughs> they get zapped. <laughs> Although they get they probably get slammed. When they get when they find when the fifty year olds probably slam as hard as possible. Ugh. At that point, it's probably nothing but just it's either like gentle Kenny Loggins lovemaking or pop, pop, yeah, pop. Especially at that oh. point, you hate your wife's guts. <sighs> Using your you think you're cracking hard? A uh, 50 year old no. no. slamming. For no, a brief fact, I might have pulling. seen amateur home videos. Uh, yeah, okay. Violence, but short of like a football game. Like yeah, very quick. intense violence for like five <laughs> seconds, <laughs> 30 second break. <laughs> intense violence. It's a scrum. <laughs> yeah, it's a scrum. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually how I make it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to start fucking drilling. Her. Why are, time why time. are breaks yeah, yeah. frowned upon? Why do you have to do the whole thing? And why like, can you spread love? I don't know. I, I try not to let anybody get in my head. You know what I'm saying? I try not to let any out, outside forces dictate how I make love. Yeah, dude. Yeah, you're why natural. This is in, how I make love. This is Dip unique. in, get out, start the day. Dip in in the afternoon, yes. get out. At nighttime, bust, go to bed. Oh, you're talking about all day uh, fucking kind of yeah. dipping in. Just yeah. a little bit of fucking. Dipping in here and there. See what this feels like. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Popping out. I mean, it's pretty much edgy. Yeah, it might be. It might just be a latent kink of mine. I don't mm. think. I've, I don't think I've ever stopped fucking for anything. Like I've never like stopped them. Like let me go to the bathroom, come back in, keep let going. Me, like, yeah. like once I'm in, I'm like, that's it. That's we're in. This the is thing. what we're doing. Yeah, it's. I like working myself up to a nice pee and pee oh. and going to bed. Mm. Spring actually have to pee. That's a fun time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I like to pee. I like to get as hard as I can, then pee in the toilet and go to bed. <laughs> That weird pee where your penis looks weird after you're done peeing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it gets leopard spots. You ever get the leopard spot dickhead? Does anybody else have that? No. That me? Never you know that blood spot? rushes out of your penis? You get leopard spots? Uh, not. Um, I'm trying to explain this. Pro I was hoping somebody else knew what I was talking about. Mm. Yes. Gardini? Yes. That's so good, the, I don't know. Is it like a, penis. the tip you're talking about? Yeah. What happens? Well, it, It's a spotty? It's tough to explain, like I guess. Like Braille? No, it's blotchy because all the blood's rushing out. Oh, okay, okay, okay. If that makes any gotcha. sense. I have overanalyzed my dick. I'm more of a bowling pin, man. A bowling, bowling pin, I also, I've experienced that myself. Dude, I got a, me and Brittany did MDMA, obviously. Yeah. Sorry about all the I was on the receiving end of that. Jesus Christ. We started going through our phones. Never take, <laughs> oh, hide oh my your God. phones. We were just texting everyone you loved them. Oh, calling every, yeah. Call yeah, it was actually really, really, really sweet. It was, yeah, very, of course. It, was it was really nice. nice. Dude, I took a piss halfway through and I came back out and we both laughed. My, I had like furious Adderall, whatever type yeah. of penis that looks like. <laughs> it was crazy looking. It was like purple. <coughs> My dick was like purple and just like it's wild. Completely yeah. misshapen. I, drug I couldn't penis even... is it yeah. reaches a lot, especially if you don't take that drug. Yeah. And then you take yeah. it, you're like, holy shit, I didn't know my dick could look like this. Molly's all time, you go, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, that's I don't nuts. know. Everybody that, talks about fucking I know, on. I hear that all the time. Not even close. No. I Yeah, maybe people are just taking like amphetamines and then just. Dude, by the way, that was, that was miraculous. Yeah, we squashed all of our beef. I I can't believe how well that worked. That's amazing. We were beefing, dude, for years. Yeah, beefing, and it was like we sat there for now. I was like, yeah, this will be cool, dude. We get along now. It's the weird. We're both like, Molly with your this lady. is weird. Yeah, now it's gonna wear off, but that's when it's time to hit the Molly again. Yeah, yeah. Well, dude, it's no one that <laughs> double the dose this time. <laughs> you're capable of that. No one that's in your back pocket. I'm yeah. like, dude. We. I was like telling her, I'm like, we can make it two more years and do Molly again and like each other. Yeah. No problem. I mean, dude, we just solved the fucking divorce rate yeah. crisis. 
You, we got a hotel room at 1030 in the morning, took it. And just late. Yeah, there. I started getting phone calls at about eleven. Yeah, like <laughs> eleven, <laughs> eleven fifteen. I started getting a lot of phone calls, and you guys were like, "Come on, come on, just answer, answer the phone, come on, please." I was like, "Guys, put the phone. To, this is about you guys. We'll talk when you're done." And then you guys were like, "All right, we're cool now. Give us a call." I was yeah. like, you guys are still, you guys are still high as shit. We went to a PTA meeting. It was really nice though. It was very sweet. Yeah, it was. Dude, it we was, went to a PTA meeting. You guys can like, make me cry quick, dude. Really? All it takes is somebody call me and saying they love me and i'm like yeah <laughs> dude we were I fucking love you guys too i was in the fucking no snakes allowed drugstore when you guys called were you really yeah <laughs> i got teared up in there i was trying to buy some citrus skull <laughs> that's my plug in the city dude it hit me and i i don't like the oncome of that at all dude that shit kicking that wave? in i was terrified it's a scary wave dude, dude. i should hold me like a baby dude yeah. i was just like i was sitting there like all right when's he gonna kick in when am i gonna shed all oh, my defense mechanisms Dude, because my brother was like, yeah, you take it and you start like, you're like, you talk, all your defenses drop. And I'm like, did my defenses drop? Yep. Nope. 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 And all of a sudden I was like, I don't like this. You got to hold me. And she's like, hold yeah. on to me. And I was like, I don't know why I don't tell anyone I have problems. I need to open up more. Oh, fuck. That's what the Hoss man did the same yeah, thing. Yeah, dude, dude. It he was, was like, I want out of this. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> Oh my god! Like, Shut up, pussy! <laughs> Wait, so this is your first time ever doing? Molly? Never done it before. Oh my god! It's it's never done it. I don't know how you do it out. Like I have, I only have to be like indoors. Yeah, doing yeah. it at a party, I would have fell apart. I the time we did it at Helium, I was, yeah, you were on stage. Well, went on stage. That was Ooh, a disaster. That's horrible. How? It was like the first time that's, I ever really that's did crazy. it. Crazy. I mean, it was Big J got me. <laughs> he got revenge after the dosing, True. the acid dosing. That was Ari. That wasn't even me. True, but. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he brought me on stage, and he was like, "See, it's not that funny." <laughs> I was like, "Oh, dude, I'm sorry." Oh my god! Yeah. Uh, but then, anytime at Helium, I would go to the manager's office. No, oh, just yeah. sit there. I couldn't be around the gas digital gremlins. <laughs> True, <laughs> that, is, that harsh is. <laughs> yeah, even though they're the ones supplying the molly, so I can't be mad yeah, at. Yeah, them. yeah, that's what I was curious about. What is the harsh? I I was curious how it could be harsh because I was there, dude. We were sitting in a hotel room. Like coiled around each other, like yeah. an anaco- we were just like two snakes, yeah, completely coiled and just being like, "I love you so much, dude." Oh my god, dude, I was yeah. pure. I went Sir Galahad instantly. I was like, "I love you so much. Girls are the best. I love girls." <laughs> 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 you guys are so fucking weird, but seriously, you're so cool. Yeah, it was, dude. It was four hours of just. It was. I I do think it is the best thing in the world it for is. a married couple. You have to do it. Yeah, prosthetic hey, love. If you're single, get after <laughs> Crazy. it. It's not prosthetic. It's not prosthetic. It's not prosthetic. <laughs> you're chemical defense. love. Dude, I'm telling you, that's what everyone thinks, but you're dropping defense mechanisms that are also distorting reality. But it is also sending a bunch of whatever the For chemical sure. to make Serotonin. you happy yeah. is. Serotonin, Makes things yeah. feel yeah. good. For sure, but it does. It, dude, I, I don't do Yeah, I, you get to speak totally yeah. honestly. Yeah. And just hearing somebody tell you how much they love you makes you, you're like, oh, damn, I yeah. love you. Dude, but I'm telling you for a marriage specifically, yeah. it's bizarre. Yeah. Because you just squash all these weird beefs you don't know you have. And all of a sudden you're like, you're all right. Yeah. It's nice. We we did Molly the whole time growing up in Ireland. Everyone's on Molly in Ireland. Mm-hmm. Like, we eat. That's why they're always after you guys lucky charms. D- yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why like everyone's like, yeah, I take it. And I'm like, dude, I had like a profound effect on me. Although yeah. I'm sensitive to stuff, so I think everything. No, does. it does have a really profound. Okay. Like if you take it, it depends. I think it depends which kind you take. Yeah, obviously, oh. some people take like amphetamine laced or mm-hmm. whatever. Yeah. Ecstasy yeah. has all types of shit in it, but like, just straight Molly is, yeah. It was crazy. Every time I've ever done it, I've been like, "This that was the best thing I've ever done in my life." And there's not really a hangover. Everybody talks about this. <laughs> oh, I get terrible. Down, I hangover. get bad. Come really, I yeah, it's usually. It. I think it's probably like you said from. Amphetamine, it's like the come down. Oh, yeah. I, 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 was like little, I was just level. gassed for like a day and a yeah. half. I was just kind of like, oh man, like just a yeah. little gassed out. And then being like, do we really like each other now? Turns out we do. We're a week into liking each other. It's One week nice. into liking each other is pretty good. <laughs> pretty but all nice. these stuff. That's better than most. <laughs> but all these things, every time I do shrooms and I have this new profound thing, it's yeah. like one week of being back in like reality. True. I'm like, fuck this, fuck yeah, everyone. Yeah, I need back. more stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that is, yeah. The, that is immediately. The, yeah that's the trick the mushrooms are the worst because you're like i figured out my entire life yeah and then you and you're all a month later you're like, you're like ah, i'll try cocaine again yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck we're having fun <laughs> coke's the worst coke if, if, i've yes. never woken up the next day i've been like that was a great idea getting that yeah, coke. yeah yeah never. yeah never yeah stuffed fucking nose the next day yeah 
just yeah. up all night shouting at the mirror or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. That Damn. is the worst. I did that recently. Someone gave me Coke in Houston recently, and I did a bump. I love how it's always someone gave me Coke. Yeah. Well, yeah, nobody's <laughs> yeah, it's because I rang him. I it. rang him, and I gave him $100. No, <laughs> that somebody, was also part of it. Yeah. <laughs> now that this I think guy, about it. fucking gave it to me. <laughs> no, it's always, He's a drunk dealer. <laughs> I mean, it, it does happen. It is always at a show. Yeah, I know. We're done with the show. You're drunk. You just got off stage. You're yep. like, damn, I'm the man. This, is, yeah. this yeah. night's never going to end. Yeah. This is yeah. the best night of my life again. Yeah. Let me wake up a little. Let's yeah. Re- yeah, yeah. Let's get a little pep in our but stuff. Then, yeah, but then I went. We went back. I went back to the hotel room. I'm on my own, and then I was like trying to sleep. But there's a bag of coke. And I was like, I'll just do a bump or something before I go to bed. And then it's like <laughs> it's 9 a.m. and I'm finished the bag, and I'm like ringing Sam Talent nice to tell bump. him how good his book book is. Yeah. <laughs> like, then I wake up at 6 p.m. that Damn. day. I was going, what the fuck yeah. was that? You're doing a nightcap. Yeah, but it's like I, I kept doing a line of coke and then I chuck out to bed and then I go, maybe I'll just do one more and yeah. then I turn the light off and I cozy up That's and go it. every time. Well, I gotta do half the bag. You gotta, yeah. you gotta do all the bag. That's what like I do with junk food. It's like let me eat all of it right now and then I won't have it and I'll be good. Yeah, and no, I thought I really tasted the devil that night though because I was talking to myself, going, just stop, go to bed. I said that to me and I was like, oh. all right, and then I was like. Yeah, stupid ass. Just do one more. Come on. Yeah. One more line. That was like the closest I think I've ever felt to like a proper addiction addiction. That yeah. one night. And I was like, that's nuts. It's bad. Yeah. yeah. That's the stuff. It's so much fun. <laughs> it's so fun. While you're doing it, you're like, what, this is great. Right on the- <laughs> By yourself is rough, dude. Yo, that's yeah. weird. Is yeah. It? <laughs> yeah, that's a little Oh, weird. yeah, leopard dick. <laughs> no, nah, that's normal. I'm going to show you. Come on, one time, internet. Be, I've never be had this. I ha- I've... I have fucked girls without a condom and then panicked myself into thinking, like, you know, when you're over oh, yeah. in your dick, you go, For is sure. that normal? Has that been there? Is that new? I had, I had an ingrown hair that I, like, called a doctor and, and demanded he, like, amend his medical schedule to see me. Yeah. And I just, like, came in, showed him my penis. He's like, yeah, that's an ingrown hair, dude. And I yeah. was like, thank you, man. You have nice. no idea yeah, how, how it was. Yeah, as long as it's not AIDS, you just go, oh, God. Yeah, AIDS isn't God. even a big deal anymore. No, not anymore, no. I think there's no real... Herpes, herpes isn't a big deal. No one no. cares about herpes. They're all kind of fine for fellas, I think. No, HIV is just kind of like a. It's not ideal, obviously. No, I'd HIV? rather not have yeah. it. Yeah, yeah but you can get one. it down to like the point where you won't even spread it to people. If yeah. you're at a zero, but it's also a tough pitch. You'd be like, trust me. Yeah. Be like, yeah, Yo, you won't even get it. Yeah, it's a bad one. Yeah. HIV is a tough one still. But yeah. then you get to date all the other people with HIV. True. It does, dog, it does, does help you. It's like an arranged marriage. Yeah. Somebody's gonna have to marry you now. Yeah. yeah, you're gonna find your sweet AIDS queen. Yeah, colds must <laughs> hit you though. If you like skip your medicine every oh, now and yeah. again, hit with a cold, and you're like, Oof. tell everyone I love them. <laughs> I got pneumonia. They all die from pneumonia, right? Yeah, I yeah. Think. AIDS guys, AIDS gals, AIDS guys and gals, <laughs> AIDS guys and gals. It is a tight club though. Yeah, yeah. Dallas, Dallas you know Buyers I mean? Club. <laughs> yeah. All right, Man. you can make. Hey, the, I, I can know, make the money. I gotta ask. You were fucking drenched during oh, that special. Oh yeah. Oh, it was crazy. <laughs> so it was. Cra- I should have wore short. I'm. Look, are you? Is that was that the night you had the bag? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That was withdrawal syndrome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a week later. I, was like, I mean, a like, fully, come on, Dolly. And, but it was every single special. Oh, there's literally a part of it where there's like dropping. Oh, I saw it was so. Oh funny. my god! And then it was also which kind of whatever. The what transformation getting, so. But I'm getting yeah. too much into it too. But like there was like in one of them, I was sweating so bad, but my hair, whatever way I rubbed yes. my head, my hair went down like a Hitler. Oh. Yeah. So then, but then we like, and it was. It was a bad. I don't know. But no one stopped the show. So yeah. Someone should have been like, "Hey, fix your fucking hair. You look like an idiot." Yeah. So they were just like, "We kind of can't use that." But I was like, "But that's better than the other." You should have proactively yeah. drenched the I, hair. In the that's very what beginning. I think. Yeah, I should, yeah swim you should have just poured a beer on your head and been like, "I'm crazy." <laughs> so for the rest of the special, the reason I'm drenched is because yeah. I was having fun. But you, yeah, did you see the drip? There's a drip, drip right? right the drip there's a great. huge drip hanging off my nose. There's I like the, it. I think <laughs> it's it's like Jordan, dude. You're like yeah, Jordan. Yeah, yeah. It's like Jordan. yeah, you should be. The fact that I'm not sweatier, I'm kind of ashamed. But everyone was sweaty. Kurt mentioned it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have the sweat towel in the middle of the fucking I mean, special. How? Like how a sweat towel. <laughs> could they allow the venue to I be I don't know. It is, like, it is funny what it Lewis takes. Lewis does a lot of great things, and, a lot, and sometimes he misses. There's nothing they things. could do, I guess. Yeah, it, was just, it was fucking, I don't know why they decided July. Like right in New York in July. It's crazy. Who would have thought that the a venue wouldn't have working air conditioning? Well, I, I think it worked. I think it was just one of those bad venues that couldn't yeah. get going. <sighs> I Helium would be like that every once in a while. Yeah, Helium dude. would go through entire summers and be like, our fucking air conditioning broke. We got to fix it next year. Just would never get fixed. Yeah. 
be 200 <laughs> degrees every fucking show. Kind of like looking at people in the because they, they can only sit there for so long. They're like, yeah, they get yeah. pissed. It's, it's so uncomfortable wall, yeah. sitting in a fucking chair, sweating. sweating. Just yeah, it is kind of cool though to get everyone that hot and start doing stand up. Yeah. There is something about. I should have wore a white it's shirt. Literally the worst. I should have. <laughs> I'd rather uh, be freezing. I should have wore a white True. shirt and just sweat right through it. You can see my hairy nipples. It, it would have been just awesome. Bursting through. <laughs> my hairy nipples and shit tattoos just coming straight through. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to make a point. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing but barbed wire coming through. Yeah, yeah barbed wire everywhere. <laughs> it is nice no how regrets. much it takes a white comic to sweat to use a towel. Great. A black yeah. comic would have dabbed himself I, yeah. long ago, dude. Well, you got used to it. Yeah, you made yeah you made a long time into your special before dabbing. I would have been dabbing. Uh, start uh, to you should have kept yeah. it on your shoulder. Um. I should have actually, yeah, I stuck it in my back pocket like a bartender. Um, That's nice. Nice. Well, yeah. I should have, I don't know, it was hot. So there's nothing you could do. And I mean, then I was like, would I wear shorts? And then I was like, I'm not like, I just think that's crazy. Also, did you notice you were sweating? Like, yeah, of I course. mean, of course you could feel it, yeah, but I'm saying, the whole like, time. oh, did you know how bad sometimes, it was? Sometimes, I knew it was yeah. going to be that, but I didn't know it was that bad. And then I wore that shirt, which was pretty heavy too, which I probably shouldn't have done <laughs> the that. The shirt was dressed. <laughs> the shirt was like, <laughs> that was shirt. like a weighted blanket, you that were, thing. <laughs> sometimes you're pale enough. You're pale enough that you can't really see it until yeah. you would like turn. Yeah. And then the light would show how it's oh, trenched. Yeah. In, the, in the thumbnail, there's a line going right down my face. I was like, of all the pictures, you can just see this huge sweat like, dripping it's on awesome, my head. Dude. It's awesome, dude. It's Gatorade commercial. The sauna special. Yeah, oh, yeah sweat and buckets. Yeah, Kurt opens with, he's like, I'm glad we set the... Ta- it, it's, I like it to be a fucking bayou in here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Kurt's, Kurt's, sure special, swamp. Kurt's special was great. Yeah. Check out Kurt's special. Oh, so check all the specials have been awesome. Yeah, it was yeah. a cool idea to get everyone on there great. to do half an hour. Yeah, I'm glad, yeah. yeah. It's tight. I did get it all about. Lewis, got few, is, Lewis got, is great. Yeah. Gomez is the best. Gomez is the man. So funny. Every single thing. Did go, when's, Lewis, when's Gomez? Did he release his yet? Yeah. 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 Nice. I don't think. I love Lewis like nearly more than anyone else in the world. Like, yeah. I, like He's so funny. Yeah. We, I opened for him one time and we got into a street race Street race with the kids. We like pulled up at a red light. These kids pull up and he just, Lewis just starts rev- revving his yeah, engine yeah. at them. <laughs> and then they went, <laughs> and then Start, we went yeah. into like some like residential estate. Flying, and he had to pull over. It's like, I'm ah, we'll, like, probably get in trouble. And then I brought it up to him. He was like, oh yeah, that did happen. I was like, <laughs> he, he, yeah, he has like a, 20, 20 things like that a day happen yeah. to him, which is like a highlight of my year. Yeah. Remember the time we got in the street race? He's like, no. Yeah. Like that was not like the even... top move when you first get your license to fucking pull up at the red light and go vroom, yeah. and oh. just find someone to race you. <laughs> yeah. Fucking tight. But then, like, you know, after you're like 17, you're yeah. like, I'm not doing this. Yeah, this, is, this, is, this is like an impulsive 16 huh? year old kid. <laughs> it is his strength, though. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's so f- <laughs> to be that Spencer's gift shop that long, dude. <laughs> he's full Spencer's gift shop. The first time, the first time I ever, saw, <laughs> the first time I ever saw Lewis, he crashed a drone into a car outside the creek. Course, <laughs> I swear to God, like his first interaction with him, and he goes, ah, like just yeah. laughs. Oh him. fuck! <laughs> <laughs> fuck! He's just always like that. Everything he ever yeah. does is just wild. Yeah, he's yeah. the man. Yeah, really, he's is. the motherfucking yeah, he man. So check out Lewis's. What else yeah, is going on besides the uh, comedy special? Me? Yeah, what's going on in the personal much. life? Nothing. What's going on in your deep personal life? My girl wants to get married in oh. Ireland now. So Really? I haven't proposed yet, but you know, you know, just you know how they are. I was just over there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How was that? What a shithole country. Oh. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, that hurt. No, it was awesome. It yeah. was awesome. Did you have Dublin's awesome. Because awesome. you did that late show. I wanted yeah, to ask yeah. about that. Vicar Street was amazing. What a club, right? Or what it a was, room. Was, I've never, that's like my, that's my dream place. That place uh, was perfect. Uh, yeah. That's the, that's the like place that all the comedians that's play. That's the homecoming. Yeah. And I, that's my, I don't know what you call it, but that's the goal I've you always, should, I've always wanted to do it. Yeah, but I, I, not that I sell any tickets. You could sell a thousand tickets in Dublin. You think so? I do. Maybe, maybe not. The specials out. Yeah, yeah check dude. it out. But uh, you did a late show, which is unheard of. Like, oh, in when they add shows, they usually just add second, like the next day mm-hmm. in Ireland. It's very rare. It's more of an American thing to have two shows on the same day. And uh, when and I, because Tim Dillon did his the late show, yeah. he said it was. He couldn't. There was a, fi- a fight broke out immediately. Someone, <laughs> True. Tim Dillon came out to a late show. First person says something like. Um, fuck Catholics Someone said in the front row And then the whole crowd Was like Boo Is that Trump yeah, yeah. Or something Classic They couldn't even yeah, <laughs> Classic that's, Ireland Dude Yeah no one would remember This sex yeah. show Well they wasted Ready They were They were hammered But it wasn't anything No Too bad They were uh, No because Irish crowds are funny Yeah yeah. They're like smart Even while they're hammered And yelling shit It's still kind of funny yeah. yeah For some reason it was It made me a lot less angry Than an American crowd 
because yeah, when yeah. they when they heckled, it was every like fucking late show I do, the crowd's hammered. Foo! Like throwing up, <laughs> screaming, people yeah. puking everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> people throw I up was, every single show. Yeah, I was there the next night after someone. You were in. Where were you when someone puked up Fort Worth, Texas? Fort, well, that was yeah. no, no, that was Fort Wayne, Indiana. That's that Fort was, Wayne, sorry, that was right. an iconic bad show. That's cool. That's your Beatlemania, though. It's just Beatlemania. It's guys thirty-five puking. year old dudes. You're like, Ugh. <laughs> yeah, for real, girls Ugh. passing out. They fucking puke. <laughs> oh the, shit. Ugh. <laughs> the theater <laughs> where was i this week detroit, detroit people threw up <laughs> wow <laughs> they were like this is good they're the people that own the venue were like it's really great to have you but they were there was so many people threw up <laughs> dudes puking every show <laughs> then i get they always tag me before the show it's like 10 a.m. They're like, pre yeah. can't oh, wait to fucking God. see you. Like, and you go, he's only a pro. I'm like, dude, that guy's never going to make the show. <laughs> I, <laughs> the yeah. shows sell out months in advance. And dude. then I get there, there's like 500 <laughs> empty seats from dudes well, that didn't make the what show. What was the polo shirt everyone wore? It's uh, funny, yeah, the, yeah, a guy yeah. getting up early, putting on the Shane Gillis polo, oh, fucking yeah, all the day long. Tonight's going to be sick. Tonight's going to be <laughs> awesome, dude. <laughs> oh, I got to go home. <laughs> Comedy clubs was way worse than theaters, because theaters I can't see. Yeah, true. And there's not like a rush of like mm. waitresses and staff. But yeah. the old, uh, when I was doing clubs, it would be throw up into your glass. Oh. That was a consistent. <laughs> That's a gentleman, though. That's kind That's of just funny. It was like, Is it, it the was rewind a on natural. The night? Just, oh. It was a natural thing that people just instinctively were doing. Like, no one was communicating. This. Don't want to miss the oh, show. This is just a common thing where dudes will just throw up right back into their pint glass. It's instinctive. And they did it at, like, back-to-back -back shows, <laughs> I remember. So and I was gross. like, hey, this is crazy. Why are they doing this now? <laughs> no one even rushes to go to the bathroom. No. They just sit at their table. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> straight onto the what, fucking the floor. Ah, <laughs> immediately. There Not was a great. good the lady in the la lady in New Jersey was my favorite because she threw up and she was the I was the only one that could see her throwing up because she was doing it she was in the front row and she was doing it very quietly but she was <laughs> she was drinking red wine oh, so I just, no. she was just going <laughs> just a fountain of red puke. <laughs> And, and I just, just in the middle of I just had to stop the show going, she's throwing up right now. Oh. Uh, Fort Wayne, and a guy threw up <laughs> straight onto the floor. It was so loud. It was so loud. He was like, <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it made me cry. Like morning sickness. Yeah. <laughs> it's, so, oh, it's a funny scene. Throwing up's hilarious. Oh, my God. Throwing <laughs> up and ruining an entire show. <laughs> oh, oh, that, yeah. It was all that the time, was, though. Uh, like, Good. Yeah, get this I'm burp fine. out. I'm gonna get this burp out. Oh, <laughs> oh fuck. I should get up. I should go to the bathroom. <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> You're in the middle of a bit. Just... <laughs> yeah, well, poor Wayne. I ended the show. I was like 25 <laughs> minutes into a set, and I was just like, "This thing's done, right? Everybody, we're oh, done." God. Yeah, they were messed. There's up. a Civil War guy in the front. He lived. Half the crowd looked like they were from the Civil War. Like just beards, just pieces of shit, dudes from Indiana. <laughs> The guy in the front was so blacked out, he just he had his head down the whole time, and occasionally he would just be like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, all right, man. Waitress was doing the fart noise. That was that same show. Waitress, what? literally, while Tommy was on stage, a lady went, mm. real loud. Yeah. I thought it was a fart noise. I thought somebody actually farted. I mean, I was like, damn, that's hilarious. Yeah. And yeah. it was a waitress walking by me. Was like I did that. <laughs> like as a, a waitress, oh. literally heckled a comedian. Oh my god! And then she bragged about it. That's and how, then she yeah. told me that and the whole staff loved it. They were laughing. Oh. She was helping the show. And then I got on stage. And as soon as I got on stage, I heard the part noise again. I was like, "Was that the waitress?" <laughs> and they were like, "The owner's leaning as well." Like, yeah. <laughs> I was like, "Dude, <laughs> what are you guys doing?" That's great. Lady in the back just kept going. Show us your tits. <laughs> oh. Do Trump show us your tits? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, guys, look, this show is not going to be good. Uh, yeah, we're please. thirty minutes in. This is it. Yeah, let's wrap uh, it up. guy threw up. They were like, should we clean? Should we clean it? I was like, yeah, you should. Yeah, you should it, just you clean. You it. should be able to charge them like an Uber driver. Oh yeah. yeah. By the way, if someone throws up during your set, they should pay you two hundred fifty. There's bucks. no repercussions. You, you can know, go you're... into a venue and puke on the ground. Did you know the driver only gets like I think a hundred dollars of that two fifty from Uber? I found out, dude. I I an Uber fee like they they take Uber a takes yeah. like half of the puke fee. So if you're a driver, you get you only get like a hundred. That's yeah. crazy. It's not even, dude. I I set my uh. I thought it'd be funny to set my chat preferences. I do Uber Comfort and I set yeah. it to Happy to Chat, 
And just oh. to see if, dude, <laughs> the chat. drivers see it. You watch them click it and go, hey, man. And they start oh, a conversation. It's the to... funniest fucking thing. It's so fun. That's nice. You get like Mexican guys that are like, oh, what's up, man? I have a gosh, cool, man. And you're like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude, yeah. yeah, man, it's cool, man. And you yeah, start doing yeah, yeah. They have to talk to you. And it's so fucking funny. That's actually sick. Now that I'm thinking dude, about it. Dude, happy to chat is the move. I just, I just get fucked up when I get the wrong... When you miss, you don't know what his politics are. Mm -hmm. you, you get a quick judge. You're like, all right, this guy's yep. obviously against the vax. Dude, I whiffed on Hit him with it. He's yeah, just uh, like, what? Yep. <laughs> like, all right, never mind. I whiffed on it hard. I whiffed on it recently when I was like, the guy was talking about, oh, I was getting my, picked up my car. I got, you know, new shoes on the CRV, dude. Pretty tight. Sick. I got new, fuck, you know, put some new boots on that thing. Throw but some the, D's on it. Do some good years on there. Yeah. <laughs> I was talking to the guy who was running the lot, and he was like, the cars were locked up in this, like, chain-linked compound-looking thing. And I was just like, yeah, it sucks, man. And I was like, yeah, well, fucking we We're, like, agreeing on everything. I was like, yeah, well, fucking COVID. Everyone covered their face for two years. The guy holding a mask. I was like, fuck. He was like, yeah, well, you know, yeah, I guess so. I got it, yeah. And I was like, just shit, my yeah. bad, dude. That was, I ran into that in Texas. The Like, the first show I did back mm -hmm. was at Hyenas, and it was packed. And I was, I was even like, God damn, this is, there's a lot of people in one room. Yeah, I remember that, yeah. dude. It yeah. was fucking like, they were like, we're at a quarter. <laughs> well, yeah. yeah. There's a lot of people in there. And then I went out to the bar mm -hmm. and this jacked, bald bartender from Texas. I was like, this guy's, this guy's got to be against it. I was like, fucking everybody's afraid of COVID. I'm not afraid of COVID. This shit's for pussies. He's like, I was in the hospital for three months. I was like, <laughs> my bad, bro. I was like, who's getting sick? Fucking old people and pussies, right? <laughs> He's like, I was on a ventilator. <laughs> like, I right, my, bad. my bad, dude. <laughs> it's also yeah. funny not to keep that to himself. He's yeah. like, yeah, yeah. Like, actually, I was. I, I actually, guess he almost died. So I guess I'm a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> you new call COVID, me a pussy? New like, yeah, nice. I guess. Yeah, I like this new stuff. New COVID's good. I'm still sick. What's going yeah, on? I've COVID for three weeks. New COVID, you got COVID now? Yeah, new COVID. Is it? Yeah. We, got a we should just mask kids. I can't. I already. I got COVID two years ago. Yeah, so I got COVID too. It's coming yeah. back for everybody. No, back. you can't get it twice, can you? Uh, well, yeah, maybe. Uh, yes, you can. Oh, but uh, I might not have COVID. Did you get I might faxed? just have a cold. Yeah, I got one. I got one of them. I maybe got two. faxed. Yeah, they got me once too. Did you? Yeah. Yeah, I feel it's a regret, but whatever. It, dude, you know just what? one. Sick. I just, I just went with the crowd. I just thought, you know, just, like my you, girl but was you got going just down. Just one. Yeah, I went down. Yeah, my girl was going down. I was like, I might as well head down with you. Yeah, got it, and then I was like, I never cared really. Yeah, so, yeah, I didn't. I I wasn't staunchly against it when I got it. Yeah. I was just kind of like, I just don't feel like walking to Walgreens. So you never yeah. got the set. You never got the <laughs> set. Like, That's kind of no. a long walk. I walk past it every day. Yeah, <laughs> no, I'm pure blood. Yeah, you still pure got the blood. good one. Damn it, I'm not gonna be so mad when so I can't have nice. kids. <laughs> I yeah. can't pass on. The I heard kids. women are there. Someone was telling me women have been getting their periods twice a month now. Oh my god! Yeah, it's tough stuff. Hell, what hell is this? What is Big Pharma done, <laughs> dude? That's <laughs> truly unleashed the market of the beast. That is. Oh my god! No, that's big tampon was involved in that. That's terrible. Fucking... I might rise up if that shit hits my house. I'm rising up. You have to. I might yeah. hit the cap, dude. That hits your house. <laughs> I might hit the cap. If that shit, if I get hit twice a month, I hate to say this because it was a serious matter for our country. I'm hitting the cap. Yeah. <laughs> It was a serious matter. We don't joke about we it. Don't fuck around. Yeah. But that's how serious I think we would hit the cap, ass. dude. If my capital gets stormed every time, fucking every time the pee comes through, I'm getting two periods a month. That's my January six every, every month. Single time. Yeah. That's January six. She cued on shamans me every single time, dude. <laughs> You start fucking up my furniture. Just bothering you, <laughs> carrying shit out of the house for some reason. <laughs> carrying shit in. True. I found yeah. this at Home Goods. It's like, what is it? It's a rusted uh, bucket. We're going to put it's a, it on it's a top bowl of the to hold fucking marbles. You're like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> sweet. I'm going to order marbles off Amazon now. Isn't it nice? Yeah. No, yeah. Sucks. I love cute crap. Yeah. Huh? They, there they was a flea market crap. near our house. We drove by it and I was like, dude, one day I'm going to I'm gonna get like a 30 yard dumpster and buy everything in the flea market and just throw it, it out straight in, the in front of everybody. I'm like, I'll pay for all this stuff and then just take a <laughs> team of guys and put it in the trash and drive it away. I think about that pretty consistently <laughs> with guys selling art <clears throat> to just spend a lot of money to buy the piece of art and just in front of them. <laughs> <laughs> just punch right through the frame. Just start stomping on it. They'd be like, all right, I'll have another one. <laughs> I guess, yeah. Because you know, they're not a seller. They're not. A, they don't have that much integrity. They're selling no. it. They don't care. Do whatever you want with it. I guess. Yeah, but it has to hurt. That's me. Just the meanest. It would be tight to buy oh, this great piece of work. 
I'm yeah. so happy. I got a sale. <laughs> buy the whole table, big bro. I'm buying your whole collection. And then he's like, all right, cool. Then it's yeah, you rocking you... the sheets too? Are we all rocking? No, I'm not. I, I, these are, I don't know what these are. These are last That's resort. Shamrocks, like That's a shamrock. Yeah, my, my father-in-law got them. That might be cum. My father-in-law got me these for some reason because they're like, I Wait, so I, you are married? Are you engaged? Well, no, I'm not not engaged, but close enough. We've been together for fucking six years, so it's good. Yeah, yeah, true. She's your father-in-law. Yeah, but we we will do eventually. It'd well, be she, tight. She's gonna to... leave. She, like it's gotten to the point where she will leave now unless I actually do it. So yeah. it's like, but you do, you know, you always drag your feet with Everton, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is the last second. Yeah. But the idea of getting, I don't know if I have the mental capacity to like get married. Like it's like why? Just because it's like, what about these flowers? And then the complaints, and I'm like, none of this matters. You know, dealing with that shit. Matt's done it. Yeah. What do you do? Yeah, you got to do it. You I just can't. do it, I think. Oh, well, just, they, just they, they say a man without a woman becomes a pig, and a woman without a man becomes a lunatic, so you have to fucking <laughs> blend oink, worlds. Oink. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no, pigs are the cleanest, smartest animals. <laughs> true. <laughs> true. And they are very intelligent. They're having fun. <laughs> pigs, are, pigs and slop, dude. They're having true. a good time. <laughs> true. <laughs> Yeah, you just gotta, you just have to let her do her stuff. Yeah, it's just for or, the most part, it's a, it's a fine line because you have to let her do her stuff, and certain other stuff you have to be like, it just, you can't do this. It's just at that all. feeling. Remember when you were a kid and like your mother would drag you shopping or something, and she'd bring you like some candle aisle oh, or something, and you're Christ. just like, please. I used yeah. to be crying. Going, oh, please, please, this is the was, most. You can also not go though. That's the thing. I, I yeah, I guess I guess I could be Are an absent sure? husband. Yeah, you can get out of it eventually. Yeah, but you got to be really. Yeah, you got to be. God damn it with these horns. Fucking man, New York don't know how to story. be quiet. Yeah. You got to open up the lines of communication and say, I don't. I went to the fucking Jets game. It took four and a half hours to drive from here to fucking. Yeah. MetLife Stadium sucks cock, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Is that, did you see the game where. I did. He injured Aaron Rodgers immediately got Four hurt. fucking plays. I walked I in. It. While we were walking to our seats, I stopped at the TV to watch him hand the ball off for the first time. I was like, damn, that was his first snap. Got to our seats. First play we got in our seats, he got his career-ending injury. <laughs> we'll never see him again, will we? It was the saddest. I mean, he. he uh, might, who he, knows? Yeah. He's going to have to coach, basically. He's going to have to. He's, he's going to teach that. He's already taught that young guy a lot. Zach Wilson. <laughs> yeah, he already taught him nice. a lot. What do you think of the Jets this year? Uh, dude, I think they're going to go double-digit wins this year. <laughs> That's a good guess. I think they're yeah, gonna, I, like I, that, Lamizi. <laughs> <laughs> we were listening to uh, Cameron oh, and Mason's podcast. <laughs> Which one? Cameron and Mason's that's podcast. That's the funniest podcast. It's my favorite, dude. Yeah. It's easily my favorite I like podcast. how we sometimes I, we take criticisms for saying gay too much. Dude. People are like, that's not funny. Watch Cameron and Mace. Watch the true masters. Dude, it's unbelievable. It's all they do is pause, say pause. Pause. Yeah, pause. 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 The whole, pause. When they talk it's, about Dwayne. It's Wh funny every single it's time. It's unbelievable. Yeah. Was that Dwayne? Who was the guy who got busted for sending nasty messages? Was that? That wasn't Dwayne Wade. It was uh, Dwight, Howard. Dwight Howard was getting nasty. What Dwight was, Howard has he? some uh, accusations. Yeah, he was getting some nasty. Some pause accusations. He's, but there's the text thread came out <laughs> yeah, where he yeah, was yeah. like, I'm not gay. I'm just a little nasty. Yeah. Oh, that's what he said? Yeah. yeah. Fuck. So wait, just that listen. sucks when allegedly, that Allegedly, <laughs> allegedly. I mean, dude, if he can stick to it and be like, I told you I was just a little nasty, everyone would be yeah. like, all right. Yeah. That's, what, that's what Cam was basically saying. Like, Joe, Paul's just like, Paul, just like, dude, you'd be like, Paul's, bro, I don't even care. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny every time. They laugh. They didn't even say anything. They're, they put out a clip talking about it where they laughed for two minutes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they didn't even talk. It. They went, yo, man, your boy. <laughs> that's how my boy that's your boy, bro. That's it. And it's just 80,000 views on YouTube. Yeah. Of them is going, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what's funnier than that? What's funnier than grown men laughing about another grown man being gay? <laughs> That's so funny. Also, but they were kept being the fucking uh, fucking eggplant emojis because they made the girl read it and she was like, I'm not gay. I'm just a little nasty. Let me see that eggplant emoji, crying, laughing emoji. Dude, it's so yeah. fucking. And they'd be like, oh, it's so shit. <laughs> Yo, I got gay family members, but. Pause, yeah. dude. For real, pause. I do do you. Yeah. I do like that take though. It's like, yo, I don't even care what you do, but like, just like, it is be funny. honest, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. We need to know what's up with you. Yeah. Oh my freaking oh my God. gosh, dude. Guys. Oh my God. Yeah. Football is in full swing yes, with dude. another week of epic games. When you're looking to add to the fun, look no further than dot dot dot. DraftKings Sportsbook, Draft an official Kings. sports betting partner of the NFL. New customers can bet $5 on football and get $200 instantly in what? bonus bets. Yes. 
bonus bets. Jesus. All DraftKings customers can take advantage of two new offers every game day this September. Get in on the NFL Week 2 action with DraftKings Sportsbook. Download the application now and use code DRENCHED to sign up. New customers can bet just $5 and take home $200 instantly in bonus bets. Only on DraftKings Sportsbook with code DRENCHED. The crown is yours. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER or visit www.1800gambler.net. In New York, call 877-8-HOPE-NY or text HOPE-NY-467-389. In Connecticut, help is available for problem gambling. Call 888-789-777 or visit ccpg.org. Please play responsibly. On behalf of Boot Hill Casino in Missouri, Kansas, 21 plus age, on jurisdiction, 40 in Ontario, ctkng.co slash jazz football jazz facility. Eligibility and deposit restrictions apply. That was so good. Thank you. That's so hard to do. I dude. skipped a lot. <laughs> no, you didn't skip any. <laughs> no, I didn't Let skip me tell all. you my picks, dude. <laughs> what are your picks? I don't know. I got to take a look here. I'm going to start with some college football. Notre Dame's minus 34 and a half against Central Michigan. I'm staying away from it, but God, I like that. I like taking the Irish. <laughs> I wouldn't dare put money on that. I like, uh, ooh, you know what a nice one is? I was minus 28 and a half against Western Michigan. I think I was obviously going to kill them, but they usually don't score that many points unless this is a new Kirk Ferentz offense. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think of the fucking good games. What's the pick? If it, My pick is... Let me see the big football matches this week. There's not any fucking really great games. Uh, might as well put me in a coma for that week, dude. I know. I hate when there's not good football. (laughs) Colorado's minus 23 and a half against Colorado State. You big on Uh, the Buffs have a pretty good offense that doesn't scare me. Uh, All right, sorry, I'm wasting time. Let's go to the NFL because yeah, I I know you like your birds. Mm-hmm. Minus six and a half against the Vikings. That scares me to death. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any picks, dude. I don't have any good ones. Minus I mean, the six nine, against the Vikings? The Niners were an easy one last week. That yeah. that, that was an easy victory. Mm-hmm. These lines are a little fucking psychotic and scary, Matt. <laughs> I would just go uh, all the friends of the podcast touchdowns. Yeah, true. Just put money on Gabe and Christian McCaffrey, Kittle. Juice check move. might find it. That's a good move. Spencer Brown fumble recovery touchdown, That's plus that. nine hundred thousand. You could put twenty bucks on that. With gambling, if the average gambler loses a lot, what I would say is find someone you know who gambles, ask them what they're picking, just pick the opposite of them. Oh yeah, because then you're betting against the single yes. gambler. There, you know, what and I'm they're saying? a loser. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, find one of your friends with crippling gambling debt. <laughs> just bet against them. And just call them and be like, what are your picks, dude? You're really good at this. <laughs> All right, what else we got? <laughs> Game time. Before you buy those big concert tickets off that stranger from Craigslist, you need to check out Game Time. Game Time is the fast and easy way to buy tickets for all the sports, music, comedy, and theater near you. They have killer deals on last-minute tickets. So even if you're looking for something to do tonight, Game Time will make sure you have a great time. Oh, my God. We're using Game Time tonight to go see Run the Jewels. Yeah, we're buying Game Time. We're getting Game Time tickets to go see Especially if you have something to do tonight. Yeah. With images of your seat's view so you can know exactly what you're getting to their lowest price guarantee where Game Time credits you 110% of the difference if you find tickets elsewhere in the same section and row for less. Game Time is the best way to buy. It's the fastest growing ticket app in the country and for good reason. With just two taps, you could have the seats for our next show. Yes. Snag the tickets without the stress with Game Time. Download the Game Time app, create an account, and use code Drenched for twenty dollars off your first purchase. Terms apply. Again, create an account and redeem code Drench Drenched for twenty percent off. Download Game Time today. Last minute tickets, lowest price guaranteed. Colm Colm dropped the Drench special, dude. He did. Colm dropped the absolute Drenched icon, smash, dude. dude. Icon. We're getting that soaked. <laughs> if you're going for the clean shaven look, but hate the mess and hassle of a yes. wet shave. Manscaped has something for you. The handyman, Manscaped's new electric face shaver, lets you shave up to three days of growth, no water or shaving cream required. With both a long hair leveler and foil shaver blades, no matter what, you, <laughs> whatever, no matter what look you want, the handyman is here to yeah. help. It is so convenient to shave my face with their razors. 
usually I have to walk to the store to buy them, but they just come in the mail to me and I go, nice. Yeah, I go, ooh, what a nice treat. I'm going to shave my pubes and face. <laughs> I have three days of growth. I better get this under control. Yes. If you're a guy on the go, you never have to leave the handyman at home. Perfect for travel. I might pause this ad a little bit. Dude. Yeah. They, Perfect for travel. They always have gay shit, what dude. the hell? Perfect for travel. It's both <laughs> compact and airplane friendly. Manscaped. Pause. <laughs> Get 20% off and free shipping with the code drenched at manscaped.com. That's 20% off with free shipping at manscaped.com and use code drenched. Hit the refresh button with the handyman. <laughs> dude. Pause. Pause that up. Last fucking one. Here's a drink oh that's God. fun without the hangover. It's called Liquid Death, and it comes in these awesome tall boys. Yes. They make mountain water, flavored sparkling yes. water, and even iced tea. So no matter what you're in the mood for, Liquid Death has you covered with flavors like <laughs> <laughs> with flavors like rest and peach, mango chainsaw, and convicted yeah. sex melon. <laughs> Stock your fridge yeah. with the best healthy beverage around. <laughs> Oh man, yeah. What's your personal flavor? Convicted sex <laughs> melon offender. <laughs> Liquid death is infinitely recyclable. Liquid death's infinitely recyclable cans are great for the I environment. Know, I like I like child grapist. <laughs> 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 I like lady who killed her kids. Yeah. Punch. Melon. Punch. <laughs> uh yeah, they don't pollute, so they're good for that. You can you know, and even they donate a portion of the profits from every can sold to help kill plastic pollution. Plus, they got the best swag in the game. That is Check good. out their heavy metal inspired hats, tees, rolling trays, and tiki mugs. You can find Liquid Sick. Death's healthy beverages on Amazon or at a re retailer near you. And Matt and Shane's secret podcast listeners get 20% off their first Liquid Death apparel purchase available exclusively at, exclusively at liquiddeath.com slash drenched. Exclusions may apply. That's liquiddeath.com slash drenched. And also, really quickly, please come to Salt Lake City. That's this oh, yeah. weekend, 915 and 916. Comedy at the Carlson in Rochester, New York, 922, Damn, 23, Tacoma Comedy Club. <laughs> Spokane Comedy Club, the Comedy Zone, Cap City in Austin. Comedy Zone's in Charlotte, North Carolina. Austin, Texas, and Magoobie's Joke House on MattMcCusker.com. Nice. Please. Please come to Indiana University. <laughs> All the I'm going to be in Bloomington, Indiana, South Bend, Kansas City, Sioux City, Iowa, Bakersfield, California, Phoenix, mm. Arizona, Montgomery, Alabama, Baltimore, Maryland. Wilkes-Barre, Pennsylvania, oh. Columbia, South Carolina, Charlotte, North Carolina, Oklahoma City, Sugar Land, Texas, Evansville, Indiana, Louisville, Kentucky, and then for some reason again, Sioux City, Iowa at the bottom of my website. <laughs> <laughs> when are you in Charlotte? Uh one of these days we're gonna fucking our our big silver birds are gonna cross paths. That's it's gonna be a party. <laughs> uh December second. Ah, dang it. When are you there? Ninth. Giant. Damn, I'll be in Sugarland, Texas at the eh, whatever. <laughs> Smart Financial Center. <laughs> All right, goodbye. Back to the podcast. Oh, Lamar. Hey guys, also get so, in here. Get closer. Get hey, close everybody. to the camera. Hey everybody. September 15th to 16th. If you're in Helium in St. Louis, if you're in St. Louis, please come out. That would be nice. Do you have anything to say to women? Yeah, I don't I don't have please, anything. Please, please. I'm spoken for. All right. Well, oh. send her a message. Tell her you yeah. love her. I'll see you when I get back from St. Louis, lady. Lady? What are you going to do to her when you get back from St. Louis? Just some nasty times. What are you going to do to her? <laughs> I don't know. Just some gross stuff. Say it to the camera. <laughs> Tell her what you're going to do to her. We're going to have sex in our furry costumes. No, for real. What are you going to really do to her? <laughs> yeah, that's, I'm going to cut a hole in my furry suit. Are you going <laughs> yeah. to pie? Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm a CP. Are you going to pie her? Yeah, dude. I'm a CP, dude. Nice. <laughs> you gotta fill her with your gack. <laughs> well, they said that about Rog Rogers is in the closet. That's a rumor. Rogers? Yeah. Aaron Rogers? That's around for long. No, because the ex. Well, first of all, it was Brett Favre started it, I think, when he was a rookie. Oh, really? Or something like that. Well, Brett like, Favre's a beast, so obviously yeah, he's gonna call his He's like, oh, no, he's in the he's closet. He's gonna call his competition gay. Yeah. And, but then. 
Like a true beast. The master. <laughs> he's the best. <laughs> oh, we were just talking about it, weren't we? Yep. He's, he, he was, was like addi- the first dick pick guy. He was right? like addicted to pain pills. Oh, was he? Yeah. Yeah, and he was playing games and people were like, God damn, this guy's taking risks. He's a uh, gunslinger. No, he's just on pills. Like, <laughs> he was out of his head. <laughs> <laughs> just fucking Uncle Rico <laughs> dropping back. Just, <laughs> he, he, like, God damn, he's a genius. Yeah, he, he got busted for the dick pic. He was the way. He was, he was, he the, was one of the first yeah. people to ever yeah. send a dick pic. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, you know what? He was up there. First yeah. busted. Yeah. The baby sent it to was hot though. Oh yeah. I yeah. Forget her name. She was pretty wonderful. And uh, and now he's now yeah. everyone's turned on him because he he stole all that COVID money or something. He yeah. stole COVID money. I, I don't know. Exactly. Oh yeah, he, he scammed his daughter's volleyball he team or something. Vo- no, he's, he got Southern. He scammed the state of Mississippi <laughs> to get Southern Miss volleyball a nice fucking volleyball facility. Oh, that's Sick what he spent move. it on. Yeah. Oh, I thought it was just. Oh, he still spent it on the. I mean, technically, it's a state university he did spend the money okay. he's now a donor of girls volleyball obviously dude he's a beast <sighs> yeah he's a legend what? he's the man <laughs> dude is he sit? he just sits up in the box and is like nice obviously it's the sickest job possible <laughs> yeah my i'm gonna yeah that's the move dude. Yeah. you gotta make your girls play college volleyball so they can you can meet their friends it's a summer party what the fuck it's true i'm gonna have a couple of drinks i'm gonna go down to the summer party i'm gonna say girls what are you doing down there you guys want to wrestle who's wrestling <laughs> 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 they just get you here like Whoop. What the fuck Mr. Favre Mr. Favre you sent us a picture of your crooked penis By the way yeah. it's your penis Shouldn't you be able to send it to whoever you want That is an argument It's Matt. your penis Where's all the body positivity yeah. now dude You're revenge porning yourself What's wrong with my fucking Why can't I send you my penis dude If you don't like it obviously you don't have to look at it Decline it but it's my penis my the, phone Some people do make ah. make out Seeing a penis they act like it's Damn. The worst thing ever. They, they, yeah, exactly. they blow it out proportion It's Farm's not Farm's the man dude I'm looking at his dick right now Oh, oh yeah it. it's curly right <laughs> Oh there you go He said a flaccid dick pic I think so <laughs> What a fucking beast <laughs> What a legend Damn he sent her He sent her a perk dick Oh I sent another one It was uh, a little harder in the second one Oh god A little harder to look at Really? Yeah, flaccid penis you can look at. That's normal. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. You get a slight erection that's hard to look at. But he, he was doing the seven. classic fucking push the base down as hard as you can. Obviously, dude. It's crazy that even a fucking master. Hall of Famer has to do it. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter who you are, you're still yeah. pushing the base down like <clears throat> from the, the bottom angle. Like, yeah, the get bottom. The, yeah, the I want to get my base completely removed. The pr- the you problem, like, I want to get that, your base. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. You get that just totally lipo. Freeze through. all get that it. disgusting shit out Ozembic, of it. Yeah, Ozembic that area and just lipo it. And just have my base <laughs> and permanently. And get fatter push- everywhere else. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, fat with a push down base. Yeah, would be yeah, it's crazy. Oh, yeah. It's unbelievable. It's, I mean, yeah. I want to train. If I had a son, I would train him like Chinese women used to do, like tie their feet bind together. His cock. I'd bind his base. You'd bind your son's cock. Bind his base, dude. So a fucking bride would see it and be like, wow. Wait, why is Aaron Rodgers gay? Oh, yeah, true. Oh, that's just a rumor. Aaron Rodgers is not no, gay. The ex, I think his ex-girlfriend well, said something, too, about him. Wouldn't pictures. he have gotten the vax the, if he was gay? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Hell, yeah. Exactly. Point. <laughs> yep. I rest my head. That might have been why he didn't get it, though. That's yeah. the end of that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was his ex. Olivia Munn said something on He's a podcast. Gay. Well, she goes, I dated a footballer who would only ever have sex from behind in the dark. Sounds like a black Something guy. Like <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like black guy. <laughs> There's a picture of her with his cum on her back, like from 2014. Right. Well, the, the mother of John Mulaney's from- child. <laughs> oh my God. Where's Dylan Dennis when you need him? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds attacking John Mulaney. Yeah. Yo, you're dating a whore. Dude. <laughs> oh. Uh, I've, I've never I've never sent one of those dick pics though from with your faces in it. I could, the idea with your that, face in it? No. But it it does make it look big bigger. But yeah. I can't ever have that be yeah, so like just me up. in the background like this. Just <laughs> yeah. On my face, like what do you do? Like a hunting trick. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you lay the bear out. Yeah, and then yeah. you sit True. behind yeah. it. And go. Yeah, exactly like that. Yeah. What are you guys looking at? Pictures also, of- what face do you make? Are you like smiling or trying to be sexy? It's crazy. Yeah, you can't. You can't. I'm put, bite my lip. You got to smile, then it looks like you're a real weirdo. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like to save it I'm as about a to kill you. What are you looking at? Uh. Aaron Rodgers shooting down the gay gossip. He says, yeah, I'm just going to say I'm not gay. I really, really like women. That's all I can say about that. Straight as hell, dude. That's I like him. I straight like straight him. As hell. Yeah, that's you know it. how hard it was for him not to be homophobic right there? <laughs> <laughs> he was like, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> yeah. He was biting his fight. He just <laughs> tore his Achilles, dude. He goes, me. I yeah. love him. Yeah, yeah, I love me. Him. Me. 
Hall of Fame NFL quarterback. Yeah, yeah dude, I'm definitely gay. Sure. <laughs> Give me cox. <laughs> yeah. It's tight. He sat in a room. He sat in like a study for four hours and was like, how do I address this? He's like, He's yeah, I'm a- just not gay. I'm not. <laughs> I love women. <laughs> therefore, I'm not fucking gay. Fits of rage, dude. I really, really love study. women. Yeah. <laughs> By a fire. Just like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Is he? Is Just he? disgusting. <laughs> no, you can't say that. I'm not going to say that. I this. hate guys, hairy assholes. I don't want to come anywhere near them. Yeah, that's a tough allegation. Aziz took some <laughs> Aziz took some pops at him on his special. He called him a big dumb jock who wouldn't get vaccinated. He? He's like, guys, don't listen to him. He's just a moron who's involved in sports. He's like, you know the way all these jocks yeah, are stupid. It's tough. It's and tough. I, go, I don't think quarterbacks are stupid, though, are they? Smartest no. guy on the field. I, typically I pretty smart. Yeah. Uh, well, but yeah, it's tough back then. I'm sure when the special came out, we were in the middle of COVID. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I'm on the right side of history. This is an easy joke. Yeah, yeah. everyone did. Everyone did that. Everyone yeah, was like, yeah. "These fucking idiots." Blah, the worst blah, blah. Of the ones still doing it. Yeah. See a special come out, and they're like, "Oh, sorry, I'm not eating elk meat and taking horse medication like a dumbass." Yeah. It's like, are you sure? Well, the other, the other, pretty yeah. healthy. He just beat the shit out of me the other day. Guy's yeah. pretty strong, dude. <laughs> <laughs> guy wailed on me. Uh, yeah, I mean they're pushing for it. They're gonna. I think they're trying to get another nice COVID scare going for the Dems. Yeah, that's, of that's good for the Dems. Have a nice COVID it's scare. Great for the Dems. And then they they could potentially be like, we've cured it right before the election. It's, it it's also kind of good for the pubs too. True. The pubs like a good yeah. COVID scare. Then you get to be DeSantis became a hero. True. Although, dude, he's yeah. He, I watched him in the debate. He's yeah, of like, course, dude. He's, a, he's like a pull string. He's a chud. He's a total pull string. He's of a like, dork. And everyone knows that I stopped that. <sighs> yeah. They're trying to tell you that the black kids are better, than, but these, I don't think so. And it's like, dude, yeah. these little these these guys are having fun, dude. Yeah, cats away. True. The mice are having fun at the debate. True. They dude. get to have a little fun before the cat shows up. I I Those do like boys scurry, dude. I That's like, gonna be scary when he shows uh, up. Dude. He said he's he didn't. I guess is he's there more another, unhinged. Dude. Is there another debate? He dude, he's like he's quiet. More on it. Yeah, he's got a new he's voice. He's like weird and quiet yeah. now. He's Something got a new happened voice. to him, dude. He's got a new voice, dude. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Now he's in his whisper mode, which is even scarier. I do like that Vivek is making a lot of like fundamental Christians in the South have to like research Hinduism. Yeah. Now, like, what the hell? They got to research like yeah. the nine headed elephant gods and stuff. I'm like, what <laughs> yeah. in the hell? Yeah. <laughs> I like what he's saying, but what the hell is that stuff? I'll tell you. Yeah, that's a that's Who's a that blue lady? It's working. Who's that blue lady <laughs> over there? She's actually kind of pretty. <laughs> <laughs> now they're jacking off to Avita Bobby or whatever he is. Avita Bobby's. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they're doing good with Vivek's killing with the with the if it's if it's reaching Phil Vivek's doing good. Yeah, man. I'm getting some Phil pull me aside and be like, I tell you who I like that Indian fellas. He's got a lot of good points. <laughs> he's gonna be a president. That guy's sharp. <laughs> like, uh, yep, he's, he's sharp. It works. <laughs> oh yeah, whatever he's saying, it's got Phil. Who, I mean, who's that skinny guy with a tie? Dude? Who's that skinny weird guy with a tie? Yeah, he hit that line. It was pretty nice. But yeah, he's he'll he'll do something. He'll get elected to something or the other. He's I think he's he's dude, he's, he's he's complimenting Trump quite a bit. Oh, he, loves he might have a good VP partner. spot. That's a good VP. He probably would be. Although he's he's too much fire and flash. Trump needs a Pence. Trump does need a nice Pence man. Trump needs a smooth chia pet, dude. Yeah, <laughs> Pence is fire and brimstone, dude. He is. He, did you watch that debate? Pence. Yeah. Pence was on stage, dude. Recently or the old one? The first, the one they just Him did. Him and Kamala? Oh, no, I haven't watched no, the No, no, it's the one Vivek, Pence. All the bros. All the bros out. I don't even know. There's Random a couple guys bros. I've never seen. But, dude, Pence is so funny. He loves the Constitution, dude. <laughs> Constitution is <laughs> Everyone's like, you fucking yeah. turned your back on Trump. And the crowd's like, Bow. And he was like, I love the Constitution. I made a promise. Like, <laughs> oh. it's, dude, it's insane. Fuck you. It's crazy, dude. Guys throwing up. It's, it's my exact crowd. <laughs> Guys are just like, Vivek. Phil. <laughs> Phil. <laughs> Phil, say Phil. <laughs> yeah, it, it's it's as unhinged. It, I don't know if, you, if I'm just getting older or if it is that truly getting more and more unhinged. You it watch is. it and you're just like. Dude, yeah, Tuck Dog fuck? Tucker's bringing in a fucking crackhead. Yeah, yeah. sucked Obama's dick. I watched, I watched that one. 
I watched crazy. that. Sucked, it sucked him twice. He sucked him twice. Sucked him twice. Sucked him twice. And he could tell he's been. He's done this before. He knew. He tell, dude, you know. Look. And he said he didn't know who he was. All as right? soon as I saw him wearing the he double double wrist brace, I knew this guy was a valid <laughs> dude. <laughs> I knew this dude, guy was legit. Why would he lie? He, I don't know. The story is the, the story is legit. He fucking hit up a limo company. And was like, I'm trying to party with guys. The limo driver was like, I got just the guy. I got for the you. guy for you. He goes, Barack Obama. Barack Hussein Obama. He was just waiting outside the jazz club. <laughs> that is exactly where Barack Obama would saying, hang dude. out. The cool jazz yeah. club in the back of a limo. With a little bit, he had the connection to cocaine. Yeah. Because then he went and bought coke and then he smoked it. And Tucker started calling it crack. The guy was like, no, he smoked coke. Mm. Tucker's like, he smoked crack. And he was the guy was like, yeah, sure, whatever. Fine, we can say that. You can say he smoked crack. It sounds <laughs> I did dumb. love Tucker's face the entire interview. He was oh, very he's like so serious. <laughs> Dude, at one did you see when Tuck goes, it's fair to say he left a bad taste in your mouth. Didn't even flinch. And I went, Tuck, you nasty oh, little nasty dog. Did you get a little wink? <laughs> he goes, safe to say you're left with a bad taste in your mouth. So the, uh, yesterday I did <laughs> Schultz's podcast, and uh, we were joking that Obama was gay. Mm -hmm. And one, he of might the, be, though. one of the guests was, one of the co-hosts was upset about it. Really? And it's funny that you can't, if you say Obama's gay, people are like, you can't say that. Come on, man. Oh, uh, Meanwhile, you can go, Pence is gay. Yeah. Yeah. Literally. Like, that's a funny joke. SNL was doing that joke. Yeah. He was but gay with like, Donald Trump. I heard Obama suck someone's dick. Everyone's like, oh. The guy was for real pissed off. Yeah. Not pissed off, but he was like, come on. Don't come on. Don't do yeah. that. Yeah. He might, he might have. He What's might wrong with being gay, dude? He might have sucked that guy's dick, too. It's like. You're saying something's wrong with being gay? Exactly. That's the dude. same reason I didn't make fun of Pence for being gay. There's nothing to make fun of. Not that's at totally all. acceptable. Dude, that's the thing. He. Th 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 that's a 50-50 shot. He might have blew that guy. Whatever. He was fucking stressed <laughs> out, dude. He's on the campaign trail. He might have smoked a little coke and blew that guy. He got to unwind. It's a lot of stress. I and believe. He kept it cool the whole time. I believe too, that guy. Wait, it, do, it does keep in line with his like aviator, cool as can be. Like, yeah. Suck a guy's Wait, dick. Wait, he was cool like, about it? So cool, dude. He, saw, he, would, suck, he would smoke crack or, or coke, whatever it was. Didn't Smoke. even affect him. He just got more zoned out and kind of he would just like chill and get real euphoric. And then be like, all right, let me get some head. And so he would cop head and just be like, all right, I'm out. Yeah. He would say, Obama out. And so he just fucking, Obama, Obama got now. blown. So he got blown by this gay guy. Allegedly, yes. And then that was it. He didn't well, do no, he got blown in the in the limo, <laughs> allegedly. He didn't give anything back? No. That's that's fair. That's what I'm saying. That's actually a hard. And he went and got ice cream with Joe Biden. Right yeah, after. yeah. <laughs> they come swap. He was making ice his cream. cool. He was making his legendary playlist, dude. Yeah, he was getting sucked. He was listening to Vampire Weekend, <laughs> spitting vanilla ice cream into Biden's mouth. <laughs> oh, Barry, come on. <laughs> oh, Barry. <laughs> Where the hell are we, Barry? <laughs> When's the last time you think Joe Biden fapped? Oh, I yeah. bet it's either nonstop or it's been a while. <laughs> yeah, he, I, he bet, I think he's in reptile brain mode. Yeah, where it's either nonstop and they have to be like, "Mr. President, not yeah. now." It's just instinctual. <laughs> like he's just yeah. doesn't even know where he is. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's got to, when you're old, you must they got to fap like at least once a month, I'd imagine, or maybe once every couple. I mean. They're all, uh, isn't it a lot of STDs in old yeah, folks' yeah. homes and stuff? Because they're all just yeah, fucking yeah, each yeah. other. Yeah. They might Disgusting. just be developing organically because their bodies are just disintegrating. Do too. they find that, do do <laughs> do old people find each other attractive or is it kind of like, ugh, look at me. I fucking think they do. just fuck it. Yeah, you just accept what you, you can go, get. You go, this is what I got. Yeah. yeah. Look, yeah. Although it must be tight. There are some hot, kind of hot old ladies. And if you're oh, like, yeah. They save up Joe the Biden's an attractive older woman. True. I'd slam her as hard as I could. I'd slam her, yeah. <laughs> She'd get slammed. <laughs> I would go as hard as I possibly could for five seconds. That'd be nice. And then I'd go, God damn, I'm out of breath, man. Yeah, the first lady would get it out of you right away. First lady, any first lady. Oh my lady. God, it's an Anyone. honor, ma'am. It's an honor, ma'am. Oh, fuck, I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, she yeah. doesn't have it. Ugh. Just for the story. Yeah. Do it. Would nah, you you'd, you'd have to swear secrecy. Would you hand state? job every president ever? Hand job? Would, would you hand job a president? I think I could, yeah. I think you'd have to. I think you'd have, yeah. It's a good story. Honestly, I'd say Jerk no now, but I think it, I think it face to face. I'm I'm buckling to the pressure. Of, the, of, of the, course, yeah. I wouldn't do a hand job. But I have the power of the office, dude. And you think mm. he's joking? You go, ha ha. He's like, I would do mutual I'm masturbation. Serious. You would both jack off. <laughs> jack yeah. Off <laughs> in the Oval Office. <laughs> <laughs> They've all jacked off in there. Oh, you'd have to. 
Who do you think was the? I mean, I guess the George Washington was George first Washington president right away. Office. Yeah, mm. true. Cracked one got off. Out. No, Leave that was, me be. That was yeah, before they had the Oval Office. That sucked to jerk off back then because you had to take off like nine pairs of thermal pants. Yeah, and then just a waft of that old fucking dirty penis. Your penis. <laughs> 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 wow, this old thing. That might get you going though. You Maybe smell, you're, you're into just that. Fucking yeah. disgusting dick, and you're like, fuck. Yeah, sometimes um, disgusting. God, so dirty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes disgusting stuff does get you going, huh? Do you yeah, ever have that? Yeah, they got like shit on your dick or something? No? Do you have, shit on hello? your dick? Do you ever know? Hello? You ever, <laughs> <laughs> you don't Wait get till you get married. You I, get shit on your dick no, all the time. I, I, nonstop. <laughs> just <laughs> shit. <laughs> shit everywhere in the house. <laughs> You're on a period twice a month. There's shit everywhere. I'm telling you. There's shit. Yeah, yeah. I never got I never got shit on my penis. I've had shit on I, my dick. Shit on your dick? Yeah. And How I'm do you like it? It kind of it's disgusting, but it kind of in the moment it kind of gets you going like this is disgusting. It kind of gets you like amped yeah, up you get a bit. going, yeah. and then afterwards it's just like real like oh god, this yeah, is, I can't believe yeah. I shit on my yeah, dick. Yeah. Yeah, even like a butt thumb. I'm yeah. like, I walk to the shower like yeah, but in yeah. the moment just just like oh dude, the moment there's nothing better than having a, a butt thumb. Butt thumb. Yeah. Yes. You fucking. Yeah. Activate all the all five gemstones are in Does, place. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Feels good. Go yeah. Do that little fingerprint. This. Yeah, a little scan. Yeah. A little security door. And then, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so use your face. <laughs> face you facial recognition. <laughs> Open up. <laughs> nice. Where are we at? <laughs> so did that, wait, did, that, did that and good? Did you do anything in Ireland other than the shows? <clears throat> Went to the shows. Uh, we were staying down by kind of outside the city a little Closer to the docks. <laughs> On the south side? Oh, yeah. I'm not sure exactly where, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a newer area. It was new. They were just kind of making... Building it up. Just getting it ready. But we actually, we were close to the bridge. The okay. harp the, fucking the, the bridge. The <clears throat> That was nice. Oh, the harp bridge. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to yeah. go. I've never been to Dublin. It's, it's a good trip, right? It's probably my it's probably my favorite city. That's awesome. In Europe. Well, when I'm getting married, you Tell can... you what, it's no fucking Detroit. <laughs> yeah. They were not lying. That's that crazy. Place stinks. It really? It's just Detroit. abandoned. Lemaire, that your city sucks. God, is that where you're from? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I thought you were from Philly. Everyone there is no, Lemaire. Oh, really? It's, it's nuts. They're all Lemaire's. Yeah. It's Lemaire's. Like, there's just Lemorps everywhere. Damn, so the eight mile was Eminem was just him versus I watched Lemorps. that last night. Did you really? <laughs> I watched it. It is corny. <laughs> I thought I was like, dude, oh, eight miles on? I'm going to watch oh. this shit. <laughs> so embarrassing. Your yeah. boots are growing I was roots. like, I loved this. I realized, yeah, lose yourself is... This yourself is kind of corny, it's but, gay. but the last battle, yeah, oh, yeah, it hypes you up. So nice, dude. Yeah, he it hypes him. you up. So nice one for the whites. <laughs> it's good, so nice to see win. the whites get one, <laughs> dude. Give us one. We can be yeah, lyric. true. We can show lyricism. Yeah, Lemaire, Le- 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 what do you have to say about Detroit? I was staying in the Motor City Casino. <laughs> it was <laughs> fucking <laughs> hell, dude. Just right in the middle oh, of the city, dude. It was <laughs> hell. Yeah. Can you still buy houses there for like 20,000 bucks? Certainly. Yeah. yeah. But there's, you've no neighbors around because they're all just being demolished. It's perfect. It's like, yeah. yeah, it's like. It's the, actually kind of It's nice. not perfect. Sure. It's, 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 that's Everyone was like, that's oh, a shithole. And I thought they might be lying a little. Yeah. No. They yeah. weren't. That is that, that is the new number one worst city I've been to. <laughs> <laughs> Some parts of Baltimore are fucking true. Baltimore's out of nowhere too. You're driving it's all nice, and then they have nice. the Inner Harbor. Inner Harbor's nice. I'm sure there's some nice parts in Detroit, right? There has to be everywhere. There's probably there's, like there's a, rich people. There's everywhere. a lot of hipsters moving in there and like buying up yeah. cheap houses. Yeah, Greek Town. Don't get it up. Yeah, they'll do a good job. Uh, I just didn't go anywhere nice. I was only there for 24 hours. Yeah. I went, and we were staying. They were like, "There's no real that. There's not that many nice hotels. You mind staying in this casino?" And of course, I said yes four months ago. Yeah. And then I get there and I'm like, "Why the?" fuck am I staying in a casino? Because like, you said you wanted to. I was like, ugh. My you aunt- get in there. The food was, there's no food in there. Uh, we didn't have a car. We had to eat like the vending. It's all touch screens in there. There's no, uh, you can't even order through people. Everything was broken. Everybody's angry. Really? <laughs> Everyone's angry. It's all angry black dudes. Really? Yeah. My Aunt Peaches, uh, she got like so much money in aunt a like, lawsuit. Nice. For something, and she spent all her money at that casino. <laughs> Motor City Casino. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Motor <laughs> City <laughs> Casino is rough, dude. It's like low ceilings. <laughs> <laughs> it's low ceilings and slot machines. Dude, Hoss's metric for a shitty casino is holds up where it's the amount of babies you see in strollers past like 9 p.m. Ever yeah. since he said that to me, yes. now I go, 
every time I'm in a casino at nighttime, I go, wow. Yeah, a lot it's of strollers. It's totally true. A lot of strollers. People hitting the fucking slots with a stroller next to them. Yeah. Jesus. It's not. Yeah, yeah, dude. Watching people like limp to a slot machine is just a total joy killer. Yeah. Some guy yeah. just like yeah. walk his hip dysplasia. It's fucking him. Saving Private Ryan. Guy's like <laughs> yeah. picking up his own arm to keep <laughs> keep walking to a slot, to a Lion King slot machine. <laughs> It's like a bug zapper. You're just fucking. Yeah, those are. They are. Those lights. Just to get something going. Just like I yeah. need to just lose all my money in the world to feel something. Yeah, yeah even Naeem was scared. <laughs> Naeem, Naeem went to a gas station across the street to get some some backwoods. And get he was a, like. In the Midwest, dude, the gas stations were all the bros hanging. Like, that's where it all that's goes where you down. you catch the ops. Yeah, you, gotta, you cannot be lacking at a gas station. No. <laughs> at all. You have to sprint into the gas station. You should have called me. straight out, dude. You should have called me. I would have gave him the lay of the land, dude. I know about the Midwest. You I'm know about Detroit? I'm one of the, I mean, I know about Chicago, man. It's not too far. <laughs> Stones throw away. <laughs> I've been to Chicago. Yeah, Chicago's. I've never been where you've been in Chicago. It's chill. It's chill. Ultimately, I'm going to move my family there. Yeah. No, <laughs> <laughs> you can move you south side. <laughs> yeah. No, it's good. The south side, it will get gentrified eventually. But the, the hipsters are the ones who gentrify everything, by the way. Yeah. And they they do a damn good job, too. Yeah. Meaning like mm-hmm. they, you know, they put like nice, sweet stuff in there. Yeah. But it's coming. They're going to go do it down there. And <laughs> it's going to be a tough one. That's going to be there might be. Then Gary, the Indiana field. is going to get packed. <laughs> <laughs> Gary, Indiana, Indiana is completely black. That was the shittiest place I've driven through. Really? Yeah. Yeah, Gary. Oh, really? Yeah. Maybe. No, he's from, from Illinois. Yeah. Illinois. Yeah. But it, dude, the south side of Chicago is totally black. Like completely. Yeah, yeah. Like you go into Walmart, every employee and customer is black there. It's it's weird. Running smoothly. It's it actually does run like every <laughs> single small. It runs like every Walmart. <laughs> yeah. I, I wasn't I can uh, I couldn't like judge the mechanics. I was too busy being like looking around being like, dude, I can't be the only I like there's no yeah, way yeah, yeah. And they all, I'm only white dude in this entire there's no Walmart. cheddar bobs and they only white dude in the entire <laughs> Walmart. Bob. It was crazy. I was I watched eight mile and I was like, they got this right. The, oh, yeah. the way the city looks, they got it. They, they nailed, nailed it. it. Yeah. Yeah. I was in all black Walmart in Chicago. And we, were, we, we had to buy we had to buy Kool-Aid. <laughs> And oh, I, no. dude, so I'm in the Kool Aid aisle. I'm trying to sold out. The line was <laughs> outrageous. <laughs> I had to dude, get a ticket. I was, I was trying to lay low already. I'm trying to lay low. I'm trying to blend in. And she bought Kool Aid. She's like, all right, we need sugar now. And I was like, they got sugar in this stuff. You know, and she, and I saw people turn their heads, and Brittany's like, dude, shut up. And I was like, don't ever. I was like, you put sugar in this shit? Is there any <laughs> sugar? <had> sugar. <laughs> It's like, what no. the fuck? And I just saw heads turn. You should have asked like, for the business. outdoorsman gear. You should have said, where's the hunting and fishing <laughs> section? <laughs> yeah, I showed my ass in all black Walmart. And I was like, wait, you put sugar in this shit? But what? it's better than Columbus Ave, all black Walmart? Yeah, I swear to God. it's. All I think right. it, that place is... Well, Columbus Ave is not all black Walmart. That is, There's a lot of people going in there. True. <laughs> that place is hell, dude. <laughs> no, this was pretty... It was pretty chill. I went but again, all, I couldn't really judge... I think I went with you. To Columbus Avenue? Columbus, I, I think that's like the only... I, that's one of the worst it's Walmarts. It's the most insane Walmart I've ever seen Dude, they're just life, hand dude. trucks just, just left stopped. on the ground. Whoever stacked. was supposed to stack the shelves just stops. Dude, just, I went they, they just quit it's, on the spot. It's crazy. Dude, it used to be a 24-hour Walmart, and they were just like, no, we're not 24. Now we they're can't just, be 24. They're like 11 8 p.m. now. Yeah, that's about right. That's, yeah. Nothing good happens in Walmart Shut after down. 11 no. p.m. I bought a video game there at like, I think, 1 in the morning one time. Sick. It's pretty tight. Yeah. I went out to buy whatever. I forget what video. It was when we all lived in that house. And I sat there for 20 minutes. Call of Duty. I went to another. It might have been COD. Yeah. And I went to another section. I was like, yeah, there's nobody in electronics. I'm like, yeah, they're probably on break. And I was like, it's been 20 minutes. And they're like, yeah, you just got to wait. <laughs> I was like, what? So it's nighttime Very Walmart. European. Very, Very European. European. Very, Very European. European. Okay. <laughs> Very, Very South. European. Very down South. Yeah, just like there's, there's the hours or whatever we want. <laughs> Dude, it was pretty nuts. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. was. All, I might go back to All, my, all Black Walmart. All black you got to get down to Detroit. I, I'll, I'll be there. I'll be there soon enough. It's fucking crazy. I'll be times. I'll be in Detroit, I think, actually, pretty soon. Grand Rapids kind of nice. Is it? There's areas in Grand Rapids that were pretty nice. Yeah. Sounds nice. Yeah. Detroit yeah. lived up to the hype. Congratulations. Do you know where every black dude lives? <laughs> <laughs> Gary yeah. Hill, Michael Jackson, Floyd Mayweather. I could have got that. Give me another one. Where's Charles Barkley? He, I actually, I know where he Ooh, lives. He lives outside Alabama. of Alabama. He's from Alabama. I think he yeah. lives outside of Philadelphia now. Oh, really? He's got a house out there, yeah. 
I thought he was a Phoenix man these days. I don't know. I think Maybe I he know. just has a house Chuck likes there. golf. Maybe he just has sex with guys out in Philadelphia. <gasps> <laughs> pause, dude. <laughs> no, those are the those are the founders. Those are the there's co-founders no yeah, of the pause there's, movement. There's no way. Shaq and Chuck were the first yeah. to like constantly on TV be like pause? Chuck would say something gay and Shaq just <laughs> Give him the- looks at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> my friend, uh, my friend did electrical work at Sir Charles's house. Said he's the fucking Chuck's man. the fucking so man. He's like, dude, dude. He, he was like, he was like, I was like nervous to go in there. He might be the coolest guy. Oh yeah, you fucking met him. Yeah. I briefly, but he was very nice. Yeah. And then it turned. Yeah. Did you met Shaq? I met. No, I've never no. met Shaq. That's that's the goal. Shaq's, Shaq's dude, iconic. He I, loves had I had a dog named after him growing up. Oh True. fuck. That was, the Shaq used to be my guy. Orlando Sh- Magic Shaq. About as cool as it gets. Yeah. Shaq's the guy. Everybody thought Penny was cool because he was in the fucking Blackstreet video. Mm. I was a Shaq Diesel, man. Yeah. Penny was cool, though. Dude, Tom Number was one. a Shaq head from back in the day. Shaq's- My brother Tom bought the if you Orlando like sports, jersey. You're a young man, yeah. I remember 32? when he got drafted, dude. 32 Orlando? Of course yep. I had that, dude. Yeah. That was the <laughs> sickest. I was so sad when he went to the Lakers. He had to. He had to. He was growing. <laughs> He had to. He had to. Dude, he called. He had to go. All right. <laughs> Patreon. Go check out Cullum special. Check out Matt special. Out check, there, out my, check, check out all the specials. Check, check out all the special boys. Woo. Check out the specials. A couple of special boys. Special all right. yeah. Check out the show, the specials. <laughs> Goodbye. Thanks. Bye.